What's up, E-Bombs World? It's Jackson. I'm back with another episode of Meme or No Meme, the only game show that makes you guess whether a meme is fake or real. This week on the show, we have Suck.exe. He is one of the largest repost pages on Instagram with over 340,000 followers. We'll see if this week he can get 7 out of 10 correctly and win the game show. Let's get to it. Well, how did you start like getting into memes? What was your first meme that you saw that inspired you to make your own account? Well, I'd say probably back in 2018, I just followed a bunch of pages and uh, I just thought it would be really cool to have my own and I started one, didn't really tell anyone, like any of my friends, it was just like kind of like a thing I just did. I didn't really think it would go anywhere, but then two years later, uh, it's like kind of like a side job now. Um, it's kind of paying for my car insurance and stuff like that paying for little things birthday gifts birthday gifts for myself uh so yeah it's it's really blown up in the last like year i want to say how do you make most of the money from your accounts from like posting ads or is it just posting shout outs that kind of stuff i have a pretty good relationship with a couple media companies that have a bunch of artists that are signed under their labels and they will they own like rights to the song i'm pretty sure and so the more plays a song gets the more money they make so they will pay me uh to put like their artist songs in a meme that i make and then therefore getting it more views that makes sense yeah so like the more views they get the more money you get so (laughs) the better the meme does the better you do yeah it's kind of like like a win-win yeah exactly yeah. And when most of your pages uh, repost content, I've noticed, but I've noticed you do make some original content here and then. Um, where do you find most of your memes that you source? Do you usually find it from the same two or three pages, or is it from wherever you find a funny meme? Mainly from the other like pages I follow, like, like a repost page, or um, sometimes it's just stuff I see on YouTube, too. Um, yeah, I would just say Instagram, YouTube, sometimes Facebook. Um, I'll see shit on Facebook that I've never seen before and I'm like, oh my God, this is golden. You know, I'll just use that. What are some original content pages that people should follow? Well, there's a group that I'm a part of called The Merchants and we're just like a group of content creators. Um, you know, like there's need.if, there's Braloon, who are the two admins right now. Um, and then like Ray Ray Randy, ill.mp4, real stiffy, instep, uh, large trap, just joined us who's like the biggest content yeah. creator um it's big yeah he, yeah he's like the biggest creator right now um he just joined us so that, that was pretty sweet to get him on board with our team um who else yeah just like merch inside would be a great way to go great, great place to start um transitioning more to the game show have you ever been on a game show before like maybe in school or somewhere else probably like in high school yeah uh, i want to say like an english game show or something like that but yeah no, i've never been in like one teachers like always before. do like you know jeopardy in class or something like that yeah like kahoot i guess yep but, kahoot. <laughs> uh stuff like that yeah we've done yeah i've done jeopardy too yeah yeah those are fun all right well this is a, a meme game show so we'll see how we, well you do here let me just share my screen all right um so the way the, ge- the game works for those who don't know i'm gonna show jack 10 memes and he's going to have to guess whether each meme is a real meme, something that lots of people know, like um, surprised Pikachu or something like that. Um, or it's two. It could yeah. be a fake meme, something that I made up or like a f- format that does not exist as a meme yet or like a screenshot from something that's totally not a meme. So your, your goal is to guess which one is which. Are you ready? Yeah, I'm ready. All right. So the first meme is this one. It's a little picture of a bird holding up a piece of paper. Is that a meme or is that not a meme? I'm going to say it's not a meme. Why would you think that? I've never seen this template before. Hmm. And if it was a meme, what what kind of meme would it be? Would it be like one of those label ones? You just put whatever you want there. Yeah, like like tits over or ass over tits or something like that. (laughs) You're right. This is not this is not a meme, but it totally could be like I found this and I was like, why is this? Yeah, yeah. (laughs) Here is uh, meme number two. It's a picture of a baby in a black background. I'm gonna say this is a meme. I'm gonna say it is a meme. Yep, this is a meme. This is one of the original memes. It's the dancing baby. Boom. It's it's like from the 1990s, like early 2000s era. Oh, but yeah, shit. definitely a meme. 
It's it's one of I think it was yeah, on Evom Zoro when Evom Zoro was still popping off back then. But yeah, totally a meme. Oh, All right, here is meme number awesome. three. You're doing pretty well. It's a picture of a guy looking at a computer. Who's that actor? I don't know. Oh, I recognize that actor. What is it? Um, I'm gonna say it's not a meme. This is a meme. With no. This is Paul Rudd. Dang. It's it's from the video of Celery Man. It's from a Tim and Eric sketch that turned into a, a little bit of a real meme for a bit. But yeah, this is this is a meme. If you haven't seen Tim and Eric, I highly Dang. recommend that. Here is meme number four. Okay. It's a picture of a guy that said, I've made a mistake. <laughs> I'm gonna say it's a meme. I'm gonna say it's a meme. Uh, what kind of? How would you use this meme? It could be good for like a Twitter, like a Twitter meme, maybe. Mm -hmm. All right, so this is unfortunately not a meme. This is a picture of my roommate. <laughs> so, oh fuck! Yeah, <laughs> it's it's. I, I didn't pick you up because it looks like a meme, but it is not a meme, unfortunately. A little bit. All right, little so bit. let's see. All right, all right. Here's meme number five. Is it a picture. lemur? Yes, yeah, on lemurs. Is this a meme or uh, not a meme? I'm gonna say it's not. I'm gonna say it's not. I'm gonna say it's not a meme. That is correct. It's a picture from a biology textbook yes. that I found. Yeah. So good call there. Okay. <laughs> all right. Meme number six. Okay, this is Jeff the Killer. It's a creepy pasta. Yep. So it's it's a meme. Is a creepy pasta? A meme? Yeah. It's a meme. Yeah, okay. you got it. You, you know who it was. Okay. That's the whole point of the game. <laughs> yeah, yeah. All right. So meme number yeah. seven. What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> I feel like I feel like this is a meme. This is like a sport meme. Mm -hmm. How would you use it? Uh, like. I don't know, someone like shooting their shot or something like that? I don't know. <laughs> Unfortunately, this is not a meme. It's a picture I found online. Dang. I tried to find, I like for all these, I tried to find examples to make sure there was no memes about them, but could not find any examples of this being a meme. But uh, okay, you, can only, you can't get any more wrong. <laughs> Three more to go. For me, it's just like, okay, okay. Yeah, it, these are tough. I told you it was going to be tough. <laughs> all right, here's meme number eight. Okay. This this is definitely not a meme. I have not seen this. Anyway. This, is is, a car. this is Cars. This is correct. This is a screenshot from Cars, the video game for the PC. <laughs> yeah, this is definitely not a meme. It looks like it could be a meme, though. You never know. But yeah, not a meme yet. Be. All right, this is number nine. Oh, this is uh, from Star Wars. This is a meme. Yep. I've seen this I've seen this character before. Yes, that's correct. It's a, it's a trap meme. Uh, it's a trap. Yeah, yeah, it's a trap. Yep. That's what it is. That's what it is. All right, so this is your last one. If you get it right, you win. If you don't get it right, you don't win. So no pressure. Oh, this, this is a meme. This is a meme. Congratulations, you won. Yes. Congratulations. Yeah, I've seen yes, that. Yes, absolutely. Yes. It is a meme. Got it, it right. <laughs> Congratulations, you yeah, win. Got it. got it. You win a fifteen yes, dollar gift card to Bed and Bath and Beyond. Are you excited? <laughs> oh, let's go. Yeah. <laughs> We're trying to give right, away right. random gift Sweet, cards or you. random prizes right. at the end. The, the first winner, he won like a Home Depot gift card. <laughs> so this time you win awesome. a Bed Bath & Beyond gift card. Awesome. Let me just... I'll buy some, uh, hand. I'll buy some hand soap. Um, awesome. Thank you so much for joining Meme or No Meme. Do you have anything you want to say to your followers or people watching? I don't know. Thank, thanks. thanks for following me. <laughs> My fans. You know, <laughs> I'm not really good at like thanking people. <laughs> right. Well, thank you so much uh, yeah. for playing. You yeah. did great. You got seven out of 10. You won. Uh, I'll send you your gift card code in the DMs. Thank you. Thank but, you. Uh, thanks so much. Sweet. Thank you so much for watching. Jack was a great guest. If you're not already following suck.exe on Instagram, make sure you drop him a follow. One of the better repost pages I know of on Instagram. Thank you so much for watching. And we'll be back next week with another episode. See ya. In a Kia.